The goal of this video is to help you get your website hosted on GitHub pages for free in four simple steps. My name is Charles Kasasa and let's get started. Step 1. Create a repository with your username.github.io as the name, as the repository name and make it public. So I'll head over to github.com. I'm already signed in so I'll come here to create a new repository and for the repository name I'll name it because my username is here you can see it Charles Kasasia. I'll name it Charles Kasasia. then dot github dot io you could give it a description but that's optional keep it public and create your repository and that's it we are done with step one creating the repository now on to step two step two clone the new re created repository to any folder on your local machine step two we are supposed to clone our repository to do that come here and copy the url to your repository then move to the folder where you want to copy it i want to copy it here to youtube let me open it with the terminal so this is where i want it to be copied currently it's on it's empty say git clone then paste in that url that i copied it's cloning so don't mind that warning it's an empty repository and i know now when i check it's inside there if i move inside it's inside there and with that we are done with the second step now on to the third step on the third step move into the cloned folder and create an index.html file so in the third step we're going to move in and create a file so if i can do this with vs code you can create a file anyway or you can use any code editor but for now i'm using vs code so if i open it up so inside this folder we just cloned i create a new file i'll name it index.html and it will basically be a simple file take on the doc type if i could just put so it will be serving just a title and that will be my name then in a the body i'll just say give me an h1 saying hello world something simple so go ahead and save that then with that we are done with the third step creating our index.html file next we move to step four our last step we are committing our changes and pushing them to github now for step four we shall open up our location in the terminal you see our index file created and we shall add it into the stage with git add then commit our changes git commit then the message initial commit it can be anything and then push our changes to github that's git push origin master that's oh sorry i don't have a master branch it's a main branch that's git push origin main And with that, we are done with the fourth step. Now, let's over to GitHub and check what happens. So after pushing our index.html file to GitHub, we can reload and see what happens. So when I reload, I can see the index.html file I just created and the build. It is still building. Wait for it to build for some time and then visit username.github.io so it's still building if i visit it may probably give it five minutes to build and finish so now it's saying site not found it's still building so it will take some time but within five minutes all will be working
and the build was successful so you can visit your website at your username.github.io and this is what we put in the html of course this is a simple one we're just serving html but you could add in css and javascript to make it more interactive and beautiful congratulations your web page is now on github pages if you found any challenges please let me know in the comments and i'll be happy to help you for now that's all.